Hello guys, welcome back to another episode here. Today I want to add some details to our ponds, but for that I need some glass. So I want to build our super smelter here. So I'll bring you guys back in once I'm done with that. I log in and this is what I get, a buttload of doors. Oh my gosh, this is going to be a pain. Let's see how many doors there are. Because knowing Kitty, there will be doors literally everywhere. Wait, the door... My actual door is not over here. There are doors everywhere. What did I expect? Why are there so many doors? Where? Why did you make so many doors? This is insane. How much wood did it take to make this many doors? This is what I get for draining part of the river, damn. Let's see if my starter base has been touched on. Oh yes it has. Yes it has, because there's doors here too. There's doors everywhere. I'm gonna have so many doors after this, what do I even do with this many? I mean, I guess I can make a maze with the doors. But that's besides the point. There are doors everywhere. You know, I'm never gonna get rid of these, man. They're gonna stay. Like, I'm gonna be finding doors in random spots for like the next few months or something. Oh, it's on. I'm gonna get you back for this. I have most of the redstone done for my smelter. Not gonna flick it on because I don't think I'm completely done and I don't want to break it. But, yeah, next time I... When I come back, there'll hopefully be a building around this. And we're back. I've finished up the smeltery, so let's take a look at that. I wanted to lean a lot into the fire and smoke. I took a bit of inspiration from the deep sea vents, since this is an ocean-based base. Don't know how well I captured that, though. The inside is a bit more industrial. I have a little lava generator right here. Not much, but I don't need a crazy amount of lava anyways. Really just a building to house a super smelter. Plus a few workbench items that might be necessary. And I've gone ahead and made a lot of lime glass with the smelter, too. And I've got candles from the bee farm and the mob farm. I made these little cattails. And in the process, I removed the, like, 20 stacks of doors <laughs> that were lay laying around my base. So yeah, that's about it. Let me do a flyover. Yep, 
Yeah, it doesn't look great from the back. I didn't bother too much with the detailing. Since these are meant to be viewed from one angle mostly. And that's the front angle. At least it has a back. Even if it's not fully detailed. And with that, I'll have to call it an episode for today. See you guys in the next one.